We're at the Death Star. The Bears will receive as we finally get this long-awaited game underway. White kick returner, huh, TC? Mark Mariani. Mariani? They never should have fired Emery. <laughs> the Tennessee Titan, who actually had a long kickoff at this very stadium back in 2011. Look it up. Hey, that's a great fun fact, Bob. <laughs> to the Tennessee Titans. And the opening kickoff return, and there is Andrew Gatchkar on the tackle at he the 25-yard line. <laughs> and the uh, Bears take the field. Here's Jay Cutler on their first possession. Look it's, at that handsome leader. He's got a sweet mustache. And uh, let's see what the Bears get going. Uh, you know what's, uh, what's funny is uh, my cousin is actually in this game right now. He's number 74, the left tackle. So uh, the Bears? Yeah, so we know we know who the weak link is. What's his name? Yeah. Bushrod? Jamon Bushrod. Oh, wow. You guys are first cousin. Yep, I'm actually going to his uh, charity event uh, this weekend, so I'm excited about that. Don't you used to see him at Thanksgiving and stuff like that? Every year. He babysit me when I was growing up. Right, TC is the Bears. First and ten for the Bears at the 25-yard line of Dallas. And a give to Forte. Forte for about two before Rolando oh, that was a bad breaks play. down. Very bad play. Is he setting up, Justin? He's trying to see what his run game is looking like this game. And you can see this at the ticket.com. You can also see it on the giant screen at the American Airlines Center. If you're flying overhead, just look down and see that big screen. Second and eight now for the Bears. What do you think, Jake? Uh, I'm questionable about TC's play package here. That didn't look standard to me. I'm wondering if Ooh, that was trips right. left. Shotgun for Cutler. He has four to his right. Back throw, looking over, going to go deep down the left sideline. Oh, oh that's kick. Oh, and it hits the ground. J.J. Wilcox on the volley had a chance at a pick. It's but it's third, now third and long. Third and eight. See if the Cowboys bring in that nickel. We'll see what they do here. Well, they might even go dime. Is there anything we can... Hey, look, it's Greg Hardy. Ooh. All right, Bennett on the left. Cutler back to throw. Get... Oh, that is, uh, not Forte. Please. That's uh, Adrian Please. Peterson? No, Jaquiz Rogers. Oh, J of course it is. Jaquiz Rogers. Quiz. He's my cousin. The other Adrian Peterson did, hasn't played in Chicago in years, has he? And that was a catch in a 25-yard <laughs> gain and a big first down. Not that he is first down. We went across midfield. I don't mean the 45. I didn't mean to stop broadcasting there. Now first and 10. Martellus Bennett brought down by Sean Lee at the 40-yard line. You know what, that's Sean Lee. Yard game. Sean Lee with a concussion. It seemed like Sean Lee, though, knew the play before it was even called. Like he'd he seen was, it on film. Yeah, he was there, he was ready, and uh, made a hard-nosed tackle. First possession of the game, Bears with the ball, that's TC's team. Second and five now for the Bears from the uh, Cowboys 39. Cutler back to throw, looking deep to Alshon Jeffrey again. He catches it at the four, down to the two-yard line. Brandon Carr brings him down, but a first and goal for the Bears. Boy, they're really tough. Targeting Brandon Carr today, Bob. It's clear that they found a weak link in the Cowboy defense. And Justin Anderson is dazed. <laughs> How you doing, Justin? First and goal now. They actually spotted at about the three. Forte up the middle. Spins. Touchdown, Bears. Wow, right up the gut. I'm a little angry right now. A no respect at all. From defense. Chicago and T.C. Fleming, 6 nothing. extra point pending, 321 in the first quarter. The kick is up, and you don't go for it two? is good. Ashawn just dunked on my team right there. <laughs> All right, we'll take a break here. They will continue to play, but Robbie Gold makes it 7 nothing. Bears, 321 left to go. This is the Chicago Bears Radio Network. All right, it's 215 at Sports Radio 1310, the ticket. We rejoin the game, tied 7-7, a uh, pivotal play here. Third and seven for the Bears from their own 35-yard line. Cutler throws to Martellus Bennett, and it's going to be close. They may have to measure on this. It looks like Bennett might, though, have moved the chains for the Bears. First down. 7-7 seven, seven score. Both teams have scored in their only possessions. Gavin Escobar with a touchdown from Tony Romo as Justin Anderson answered. But now it appears it's going to be one of those games with whoever has the ball is going to be in full control. So this is the TC versus Justin Anderson oh, no. Madden oh, Challenge. Uh, no Justin almost uh, had an interception there. Skandrick getting his Justin, arm up. Justin Anderson, Maverick, rookie great is uh, playing with the Cowboys. TC is playing with the Bears. 
They are playing for a Star Power television, a 58-incher. And um, second and ten now for the Bears. <clears throat> we're broadcasting this not only on the ticket.com, but also on Who the big screen shot, outside shot. the AAC. Incomplete out of bounds. I have been uh, disappointed by one thing. I was under the understanding, Justin, that you were a big trash talker. It's been very silent in here. I'm really nervous right now. <laughs> it's, I've never played a game with this high stakes. Um, I'm not going to sit here and act like I'm used to this environment. And I'm on, Even though I'm at home, I feel like I'm on the road. You've been in an NBA playoff game or five, you know. Well, it's a little bit more uh, <laughs> tough. He got just, But he got uh, Gavin Escobar a touchdown. He did. He did. We'll never forget that. This is a big How play difficult for the is that? <laughs> Third and ten. There's 335 left to go in the That's second Romo's quarter. collarbone. Everything's fine. Cutler in shotgun. Third and ten. He has Forte. Or you got to watch that. Oh. Rogers behind him. And did he pull them offside? Are you learning how difficult it is to be an announcer? Oh, my God. <laughs> you just hard counted him. Hard count Randy Gregory, who's supposed to be suspended right now, but somehow just uh, had a crucial offside. It's now third and five. Are you guys impressed by Bob's ability to be an announcer and say Cutler over and over and not... It's early in the game. I could yet. still uh, mess that up. Uh, I need this stop right here. I need this stop right here. Third and five. What are you looking at here? All right. Let's Justin. just say, though, if he gets the stop, TC's going for it on fourth, right? There's well, no way. He's short of midfield. But, yes, he's most likely good. He's, an, he's a progressive thinking. Third and five. Hey, oh, short, short. And he is stopped well, now short. now we're going to find out. Sean Lee that. and Greg Hardy oh, in on oh, one of those oh. rare tackles. Now fourth and two. What does John Fox do here? As Justin deploys the Death Star crowd to get on their feet, <laughs> there are actually people that are cheering because he's being heckled. This is fourth and two. Big play right here. Midway through the second quarter. Cowboys and Bears locked up at seven. Bears have the ball. Oh, wait a minute. What's Tony Romo doing on the field? This is too big. Okay. They were just showing Tony Romo getting ready. That was really weird. All right. You're not a good announcer. I'm a great announcer. You've taught me everything I know. Fourth and two. Big play for the Bears here. Cutler back in shotgun again. He's been going to Bennett over and over again. It looks like he's going for a hard count a little bit. Play clock is down inside 10. Cutler surveying the defense. Now looks, throws oh, to his left. First down. Stick around right in the hole. Elshon Jeffrey there on a little hitch and a little stick, excuse me, if you will, and uh, turns to the inside, moves I the chains. right now. <laughs> that could be one of my five key plays of the game. how nervous they both seem. Well, that's what happens when uh, the whole world is it's listening. All, it's all big when you're talking. When you're playing some 13-year-old from Iceland in your uh, <laughs> living room. All right, now Cutler back to throw on first and 10. A little crossing pass to Bennett again. Rolando McClain is but there to bring it down. But I think what we're viewing here, and we've talked before, Three the game. problem with the Madden world and the gaming world in general may be it's tough to find somebody your exact same Level. It seems like we're skill. doing that, though, doesn't right. it? Right. And we had a lot of people predicted either one way or another, somebody would already be up by three touchdowns. And it seems like these two are very evenly matched. It's TC, like Cutler's why, never thrown a fade before. Why do we keep throwing those fades out of bounds, TC? What's going on? I mean, why we throw them out of bounds because it's Cutler. Why we throw them is because we already got a 40-yard completion. On no, 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 no. I understand the play call. Just don't throw it to the cheerleaders next time. It's it's just a random number generator thing. He's not being he's not being hurried at all. I'm waiting until he's dropping Gregory out of the package anyway. It's like he's doing right now. All right, it's 37. Pouting? Looks like Greg Hardy is now walking around the defense aimlessly. And, uh, okay, he's looking on that cross. Cutler is going to go deep again. Looking for Jeffrey again. Off, out of bounds again. Ooh, a car with a little juice. Not going to be able to win with throws stuff. like this. It's going to Just be fourth not. and seven now. Three seconds shy of the two-minute warning here in the first half. Both Does he go for it? Seven apiece. Yes. It's fourth and seven. Oh, he is at me. the uh, plus 40. <laughs> the Cowboys 40-yard line, it is way too far for Robbie Gold, and nobody kicks field goals in Madden. I do. Do you? <laughs> okay. We'll, we'll file that away for next time. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. The punt team is on. Does anyone buy this for a second? Punt team's not on. Why do, then who are they showing You're still the, a bad announcer. <laughs> Going it. forward at fourth and seven from the Justin Anderson I'd rather 40. just criticize and second guess. Okay. Then fourth and seven. Cutler looking to his right now. Down the oh, seam. Oh, 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 oh
It's a big stop for the Cowboys. Dislodged from Kevin White. Looked for Kevin White down the seam, and now with 1.59 to go before hands. halftime, the Cowboys take the ball and could get a lead, and this could be one of those uh, uh, make-it-take-it type situations because oh, yeah. they'll get the kickoff, won't they? Yeah, they get. The, if he's able to score here, that any, would be huge. Any kind of decent play-by-play -play man is noting that that was clearly in his hands. That was that really looked pretty good for the situation. Romo back to throw well, we and it was a bad finds play. it outside to Witten. Exactly. Witten and moves the chains and gets five, six more. Into Look how Bears he refused territory. to go down. That's one of the toughest players in the NFL and probably a future Hall of Famer. Cowboys don't like a huddle. It's first and 10 now from the Bears 44. Romo again finds Darren McFadden on the right sideline. Cuts it back inside. You know, if I'm McFadden, I go out of bounds right there. He kind of ran back in bounds to gain a whole extra one yard. Cowboys have all their what about timeouts, that, though. Second and four. What's our halftime show? Now here's Romo. He's got a man right down the oh! middle. Oh, it's knocked down there at the linebacker level by that white dude, number Shane 50. Shane McClellan. Shane McClellan's still in the Bears? The Bears have a white linebacker? When do you think they released the new Madden? Wow, a lot of passive aggressiveness. Doesn't this thing update? Today. I was told this thing updates. <laughs> All right, so what do we got here? Third and four for the Cowboys. They're at the edge of Dan Bailey's range. Dunbar's in the game Beasley. now. Romo finds Beasley right across the middle. First down, oh, down to the 25. might be coming back. We have holding? It looks like... That flawless offensive line is going to be called for holding. Wow. What and do you they think they are called, looking Justin? in the direction of right guard Zach it's Martin. It's all right. It's all right. So back them up. That play will not count. They'll walk them back 10 yards, third and 14. Do you guys now. have anything on here that lists your all-time record? Like, could we see how well you've done, TC? Third and yeah. 14 from the 48. Romo Ooh, back to throw. Has open. a man wide open. That's Jason Witten down to the 26-yard line. You know, Witten always finds the open ticking. area in the zone. Yeah, he's still going with the hurry up Cowboys here. And still look, have. he's also their best blocker. With all their timeouts, Dunbar runs back onto the field. Romo now singling, signaling out to Des Bryant. Instead, he's going to roll to his left. Is he going to run it? He is, and he gets out of bounds with wow, another that's a first down. down. Bob. Down to the 15-yard line with the Romo uh, scramble. Uh-oh. Oh, uh -oh. Looks a little, looks his a collarbone. <laughs> a very oh, wait, he went to Cabo. He just went to Cabo for halftime. <laughs> All right. This is a chance now for the Cowboys to get a score before halftime. Does the watching Cowboys this at being all? Run by Justin Anderson. Does watching this make you want to play Madden again? Yes, first and ten. Now Romo back has all sorts Dangerous of time. Throw. Looks down to his tight end Gavin Escobar for about eight yards. That's Wit. That's Wit. That's Wit. Wit with the catch. He begs no, a time no, out no, here. No, that was Escobar. Was hey, okay. TC, how are the nerves? Tired. We've got a little argument here. They're terrible. <laughs> Second and two. Forty-eight seconds to go. The Cowboys have used a timeout now. They have two remaining. Empty gun. Now, is this where Justin Anderson six. doesn't want to score too soon? Romo to throw. Your thoughts? Is, uh, lucky. Oh, that's Lucky back. Whitehead. But a flag is down. Well, if you don't want to score too soon, throw it to Lucky Whitehead. Hey. <laughs> what do we Come have on. here? Another holding? Mental mistakes. Remember, we talked about how the I'm game's going to be pretty the for the Bears. The mental <laughs> <laughs> Lyle Collins with a hold, and that will march them back to their 17. But it's still second and 12, 43 seconds to go in the first half, tied up at seven. Justin, are you surprised at the strength of TC thus far? No, he's pretty good. He's pretty good. All right, second and 12. Justin Anderson with the ball. The Dallas Cowboys playing at home today. Jay Cutler, all-time 2-0 at the Death Star. Romo throws underneath. Lucky Whitehead, same play. See? Out of bounds. First and goal at the four. Why Big game, 13 stopping? yards. You guys see this, right? Yeah, why is the clock, the not, clock stopping? not stopping? It's probably preset for the Bears. I don't get it. Cowboys take their second time out. out. Looks like uh, they're ruling his knee went down inbounds, Justin. Yeah, I don't know about that call. Forward progress. Okay. 31 seconds, first and goal at the four-yard line. Trips to the right. I'd want to milk this 30 seconds and score right really before the half. thrown to Des Bryant yet today. Oh, he's a decoy. All right, here's Romo back to throw. Fade to oh, Bryant, touchdown! Oh, command! How about that, <laughs> Des Bryant and throwing he, up the X? Justin we Anderson throws X -X. up the X. <laughs> the Cowboys pull ahead right before <laughs> halftime. <laughs> And they are going to kick the extra point to try to make it 14-7. to 7. 
Crucial 27 seconds left here in the half. We know TC is going to try to run these four verticals. All right, 14-7. We'll keep it right here until halftime as uh, Justin Anderson with a touchdown lead will now kick it off. But remember, Will he onside kick, Bob? He'll get the second half oh, kickoff no. as well. He does kick it deep. Mariani is back there at his two. Here he comes out to the 10, the 15, the 20. Ooh, right Spins tackle. out of a early uh, Damian Wilson tackle and uh, gets to the 23-yard line with 23 seconds to play. He'll spot it at the 21. You know he's throwing fades here. Good chance here to break out the wishbone, though, if he wants to. <laughs> Thank you, TC. A little football. Here <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, the Bears with very little time. They do have all three timeouts. Here's Cutler back to throw. A little pass rushes uh -oh. on, and he's going right down uh -oh. the middle. Uh -oh. It is complete to Kevin White to the 20, the 15, the 10, the 5, and a touchdown, Bears. Oh, my goodness, a 79-yard touchdown strike. Jay Cutler, Kevin White, and it is about to be tied. Kevin White atoning for that earlier drop. Justin, where is our safety? I picked the 3D coverage. Oh, my God. The safety fell asleep on the scene. That might have been J.J. Wilcox. Who would have known? And it's 14-14 with 13 seconds to go in the half. Come on, man. What? what, what uh. Now Robbie Gold kicks it deep. That will probably be one of the five plays you may not Boy, remember. Yes. There, there is no doubt. That's on the game. There is no doubt. Justin, we had them right where we wanted them. And now it is anybody's ball game. 13 seconds to go here. It is uh, 228. So we'll knock out a break here. In fact, you know what? Let's uh, assume that nothing substantive will happen in the final 13 seconds as uh, Romo th getting ready to throw. Pass rushes on, dumps Underneath. it off to Tyler Klutz. Okay, that will end the first half. 14-14, Bears exactly like and Cowboys. Cowboys. They go to the locker room and make adjustments. Justin Anderson versus T.C. Fleming in the Madden Challenge on the Chicago Bears Radio Network. The ticket is back at Texas Motor Speedway for the Firestone 600 weekend. Second and goal. No! Walk the dog! Darren McFadden, touchdown! <laughs> Friday uh, will be there, the Bob and Dan program, followed by the hard line. So it's uh, noon till 7 at Fuzzy's Taco Shop in the infield. Stop by, talk racing, register when VIP pit passes. Friday, when we have a case of TMS. Uh, we're here in the American Airlines Center Plaza. We have a little studio down here. And in this studio, we have a big screen TV. And on that TV right now, a game of Madden is being played between Dallas Maverick Justin Anderson and the tickets <laughs> T.C. Fleming. As you just heard there, Dan, uh, Red Panda wrapped up her halftime show. That's awesome. Oh, yeah? That is the best. Fantastic. So, My friend, Red Panda. Right now, there's a minute 40 left in the third. Justin is clinging to a 21-14 to 14 lead. And uh, they're playing Ooh, horse for a star power Brand new 58-inch 1080p LED TV. It's a lot of letters. According to Quirk, he wants me to note the exact terminology so I can correctly identify it on the air. And I've done so. I have one other thing I have to read as well. All right. This telecast I, I was, is copyrighted. I wasn't reading, by the way. This telecast copyrighted by the NFL for the private use of our audience. Any other use of this telecast and any of the pictures, descriptions, uh -oh. or accounts of this game without the NFL's oh. consent is strictly prohibited. Yeah, usually you Call read that in garbage place. time, though, right? Oh, good. There's like we one second our producers. And, uh, Cowboys 21, Bears 14, late in the third quarter. This is a big, big drive for Chicago and Mr. Fleming if he's going to pull a victory out of this one. Third DC and seven lives now. and dies by the deep ball. Rodgers out to the right. Cutler throws back to the left Ooh, and on the sideline to short. Kevin White. And yes, they are stopped at least uh, two yards short. And Kevin White staying down for a second. Now it pops up, but it's fourth now, and two for the Bears. And they are what? One for two on fourth down so far I was going to say, is Justin the only one who has stopped a fourth down attempt thus far? I believe that's the case. So it can be done again. Fourth and two now in the final minute of the third quarter. This has been a struggle all the way. Look how intense TC is. The Bears scored first. 
They both look like this is life and death. This is Do you being... think that's, as, as a Mavs fan, are you upset that you've never seen him so intense? <laughs> Fourth and two now from the Bears' 38-yard <laughs> line. He's more focused line. than he's ever been. Cutler has Forte right behind him. This is a massive play. Cutler back to throw. Looking right into the middle. They will move the chains. Kevin White first down for the Bears out to the 44-yard line. Block that. I got to deflect that right there. Oh, Cuban ran out on the field and is screaming at the ref. (laughs) First down now for for the Bears just short of midfield. Down seven points and we're moments from going to the fourth quarter. This huge challenge, almost a month in the buildup. First and ten now, Cutler to throw. Looking, going oh. deep to the right, he has a man. Oh. 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 Jeffrey, but it's knocked out by Orlando oh. Skandrick at the last second, incomplete. Not up in here. Skandrick, good D, big boy. He's given up about six inches to Alshon there, still climbs the ladder. Boys, by the way, I should mention, give me that. Oh. Give me all of that. That's a tough if you would like to, uh, we enjoy you listening, but if you'd like to take a Give look at what's all. going on, Good great. The ticket.com is actually Good carrying the, the Twitch stream, uh, stream, I should say. And on that stream, you can see the game, and then you can see Justin and TC. That's right. Um, you'll see their little faces, and you see Justin throwing up the X. If Figure indeed. out which one's which. <laughs> <laughs> Second and ten now for the Bears. Very exciting, Bob. Three snap motion. Cutler looking. Comes back to his right. Going deep again. Give me that. Yeah. Yeah. He doesn't learn. They continue to challenge Orlando yeah. Scandrick, oh. and they continue to get Hold nothing it down of it. on that island over there. Oh. <laughs> Third and ten. Cutler now 12 of 22, and I want to say just about every one of the incompletions so is this has been like, to go around. Is this the three-pointer theory, TC? You're just going to keep chucking them and... If, if you hit game, one of them, it's fine. If this game comes down to Alshon Jeffrey versus Orlando Skandrick, I'm pretty sure I'm going to win. Ooh. Oh, he remains oh, confident. Third <laughs> and ten for the Bears at their own 44. And now, he's doing it again, isn't he? Down the yeah, oh, 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 just about oh, picked move, off. The Bears are running yeah, into a Cowboys <laughs> secondary. <laughs> that Unconventional <laughs> dropping Hardy 30 yards deep down the middle of the field. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, Worked out for him. You got to punt that. Oh, yeah. Great punt Hardy. That. I'm, in I'm not punting it. Okay. It is fourth and ten. Ooh. The Bears are not budging. Seems the Bears ran over to uh, Garrett and told him he had to punt. Or excuse me, the other way around. Sorry. Garrett ran over punting. and told, who's the Bears coach these days? Trestman? John Fox. Fox? Should be Trestman. Looks what like about Buddy Ryan? The How's Bears he now in uh, 10 personnel. They have four wide he outs. He's probably dead. On fourth and 10. Is Buddy Ryan dead, Bob? Uh, <laughs> I don't think he's dead, but right. he hasn't coached in quite some time. Fourth and 10 now for the Bears. No Not going to get the yeah! playoff. Not going to get yeah! the playoff. Let's go. And it will now be Let's fourth go. and 15. You better punt this. I'm not punting. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. It's now fourth and 15. Come fourth on. and 15 now for the Bears. Down seven. That's what I like. 12 seconds to go in the third quarter. Come on. <laughs> Justin's been burned by the deep ball. In an unlikely circumstance to close of a quarter. On There's a look at uh, Gene Jones' artwork here at the Cowboys Stadium. <laughs> And so we head back to For action. Real? Now Cutler, fourth and 15, well, going deep. Down the left sideline. Oh, yeah! he oh, gets one. Yeah! He's caught on fourth gets and one. 15. A deep pass at Brandon Carr. It's Elshon Jeffrey the in the close of the third quarter. Winning another aerial duel, and we go to the fourth quarter. Four fingers in the air, everybody, as uh, this challenge just continues to go. Boy, that was a uh, long 30 seconds, wasn't it? Five minutes to Ooh. decide this. Your game was on. Oh, my God. The entire game hung in the he balance. And Elshon Jeffrey one like that? went up to go get that. This time working against Brandon Carr, Cowboy fans. Here come the Bears. Now at the Cowboy 24-yard line. Cutler back to throw. Off to the sideline and Kevin White again. And down inside the 20 to the 16. By the way, uh, the movie Wall-E was the one where they were very sloth-like and living in space. And Did you yeah, see that glad one? you were able to get that. Yeah. That's a good, good, good call back there. <laughs> Just for those who are tuned into the first half of this game. And uh, when you're looking at the Twitch feed on the ticker, uh, the ticket.com, Pick which guy you think Ooh, might have been in the nice movie Wally. Block. Forte, five down to the one. Matt Forte still showing he has it. 
Despite signing with the New York Jets, he is playing this one last game with the Bears, and it's first and goal. Who do you like in this one, Bob, right now? I feel like Justin Anderson. Oh, Cutler, touchdown. Sneaks it. Does it feel like Justin might have last possession, and that's why you're calling that? Yeah, I think so. But I also feel like Romo looks a little more, this Cowboy offense looks a little more reliable. In short, he has Cutler. We have Romo. Hey, Give will, me Romo. will one of these guys go for two on a touchdown and try to end this game? Or are they going to meow their way to overtime? Ooh. I think I'd like to meow my way to overtime. <laughs> <laughs> All right, 4.36 to go in the game. Lucky Whitehead in his end zone. He uh, receives the kickoff return, crosses the 20 to the 24-yard line. And now this is where legacies are made. Tony Romo has been so, so strong today. Am I hearing this correct? Because I don't own this version of Madden. I think I have Madden 84. But uh, the ambulance would drive on the field. Oh, what a great game! Yeah. <laughs> Is this uh, Phil Sims? Do I hear Phil Sims and Nancy? Yeah. Oh man. Romo rolls to his right on first down, looking deep. Oh, you had and he's sacked. Wow. Justin, oh. what do you? What's your thought process behind that? Don't throw a pick. Okay. Take the sack. Turd well, I should Ferguson. Do it out of bounds. I should do it out of bounds. One yeah. of Parcells' rules. That is Turd Ferguson with the sack there. But. Certainly you don't want to make uh, the interception would have been a little worse. Now second and 16 for the Cowboys. Go get it right here. Here's Terrence Williams in motion. Now Romo looking, looking, looking. Right sideline, Darren McFadden. Did he get his feet in? He did not. Third and 16 now. <coughs> this Cowboys. would be a huge stop, Bob. At their own 17. This is a big All right, Justin, down. hypothetically, if you had to punt here, would you? Yeah, if it's fourth down, yes. Fourth and 16. I, I, try, I believe more in my defense. At your own 15. I just want to be clear, I don't believe in my defense at all. Third and 16, <laughs> Romo to throw right down the seam. First down, Cowboys! Wow, how do you hold on to that? Baylor's Terrence Williams moves the chains. Ooh, Not a realistic game. Baylor. They're bouncing back, Dan. We're rebuilding. Out to the 34-yard line, first and 10. He held on to that like the Hamilton report, Bob. <laughs> Dan? Bob? It's topical, if nothing else. It's a force, force shot, really. 12 personnel now for the Cowboys. Shot. First and 10. They actually looked uh, play action there for a moment. Now Romo's going to put it down and Ooh, run for it out of bounds. Big hit. Is there a setting on there for injury? Like if Romo takes a couple yes. big hits, is he gone? Yes, it is. Down inside, four minutes to go. Like Romo, I would imagine, has a higher threshold or whatever, the, the number possibility to get injured. We're in a weird uh, no man's land here, Jake. Second what, it's a 37? Time. Uh, just trying to figure out where to fit this. Uh... Oh. Here's Romo now across the field to Cole Beasley. Can oh. Cole Beasley stand his uh -oh. feet? He does. First out out to midfield. And That's now, the kind of play we've seen from the Bears defense too, late, too much lately. Do the Cowboys start thinking about running just a little bit of clock here? They don't no. want to give the ball back. <laughs> or do they? So the score is tied at 21 with three and a half minutes left to go. Now Romo, first and 10, underneath again to Lucky Whitehead. This is pretty much the entire Cowboys offense is these crossing routes at about a five-yard depth. Take what they'll give you. Whereas the Bears seem to throw it 50 yards in the air every play. Second and five now. All across midfield at the Bears 46-yard line. Romo Ooh, once again right across the middle. This time it's Jason Witten. It. Boy, did you see Jason Witten just hold on to that ball with his hands? That was Y option right there for Jason Witten. Now it down kind of looked like he, he drew that play up himself. They're in Dan Bailey field goal range. He's always finding the seam in the middle. Phil Simpson making tell you a what. really good point right now. <laughs> Unlikely. 21 personnel this time. Romo play action looking deep. Oh! Back the other way at the 30, oh, 45, 40, no. 45, 50. Is that Whoa. four? Down to the 40, to the 30, 25, 20. He's going to go all the way. <laughs> Pick six for the Chicago Bears. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I think that's Romo, only Romo's fourth incompletion on the day, and it goes the other way to the house. That was right wow. into coverage. Romo never saw Sherrick McManus 
But Sherrick McManus ran about 85 yards back for a touchdown. The Bears now with 2.36 to play with a 28-21 lead. That means T.C. Fleming is in the driver's seat here in the remaining moments. Who could imagine Romo throwing a pick yeah, six? Yeah, I think that's his first career Bro. fourth quarter interception. Ooh, a little it's Andrew June. Sandman for the Devon Street kickoff return. Lucky Whitehead's been taken off duty. Oh, oh, oh. Devon Street breaks one up one to the 34-yard line. That was scary. <laughs> 232 left to go. All right, hypothetically. I think the Tom Likas show is starting. <laughs> if Justin Anderson <laughs> scores on this drive, there's two and a half minutes left. He's down by seven. Does he have the sack to go for two? He's got to. <laughs> He's got to. We will play to his competitive edge. Romo back to throw, 2.30 to go. Underneath now to Witten. Witten heads up field, but his uh, form tackled there at about the 41-yard line. That's Allen Ball with solid fundamentals. That was nice. Game One of the nine. hurry up. Speaking of fundamentals, though, did you see Witten, how he lined we up? We got it. Second and one. Romo again. Witten again. It's Mr. Out to midfield. And across wow, to Bears that territory tackle. at the 47. You can see there's no quit in these Dallas Cowboys. Try to get a play in before the warning. Everyone gets set, gets set, get the ball off, 2-0-1, they, on they got the playoff, Romo once again looking, he's calm back there in the pocket, he could actually run for this if he wants to, but he'll throw it downfield to the oh. sideline, oh, did McFadden no. stay in, McFadden's wow. a complete catch, boy it looked like uh, one foot inbounds there. Darren McFadden down to the 20, and with 1.53 to challenge. go, we hit the two-minute oh, warning. He's challenging. Oh, the Bears are going to challenge this. Two minutes, man. You're two minutes. A, uh, You're allowed to challenge? Oh, no, it's last two minutes. Official review only. Oh. <laughs> uh, That's what it it's said. not letting me. <laughs> what is the rule? Is it inside five or inside two for the... Uh, yeah, right? It so should be, but you should it's be not allowed letting to. me. Tough break there. You're in Dallas, though. I'm playing this in protest. First and 10. Now at the 20. Romo back to throw inside the two-minute warning. Once again, he rolls to his right. He has time Ooh. and then just gets rid of the ball out of bounds. Big hits. Re-rack Kyle Fuller there. Or one of the Fullers. I'm not sure which one. There's like four of them. Big well, there's Alonzo. There's He's the, four. He's the <laughs> non-consequential one who plays in Chicago. Yeah, there was Alonzo. Fuller from Home Alone. Second and 10 now. 147 Sorry, left to go in the fourth quarter. Cowboys need a touchdown. They're down seven to when the Bears. When will five-year-old Alonzo be on the GBL? Witten to the 14. <laughs> it's third and five. 135 to go. We couldn't have drawn it up any better than this. The game hangs in the balance. Romo under center. Drops Stay, back. Oh, Throws to win. In. Down to the five. Inside to the three-yard line. First and goal. Wow. 123 to go. Clock is running. Romo moves up to the line. 115. Check with me. First and goal. Romo looking things over. Has McFadden. Play action. Now throws it to oh, Escobar. The touchdown. touchdown of the day for Pablo. But it's in that weird spot. Is it too early to go for two? 28-27 now. Bears with the lead. 109 to play. What will he do? Will All right, he go so for two? he's down one. I think oh. he's going for two. I see nine. He is going I for two. I see for two. This is a 109 to play. Romo hands it off to McFadden. Oh, he does not get in. He does not get in. Oh, no. Bears 28, <laughs> Cowboys 27, 109 well, the to go. Was there, and and then now the Cowboys have to decide, do they kick it deep? They have all their timeouts. Or have you ever seen TC fist pump and scream Is like Bailey's that? Bailey's onside kick? Onside kick, Bears have Right it. to a Bear receiver. And now with 107 to go. Justin Anderson. Are you going to stop ball? Oh, yeah. We're in a, beer, we're in a weird place here. He's stop balling. 107 to go. All I'm trying to do is win. Bears have a one-point lead. Wow. Justin Anderson with the Cowboys has to force a turnover or this game's over. TC is Holding. handing Holding. the ball up. Right the it's already coming back. Holding. Got a minute four left. What do you want to do? <laughs> Let's... Uh, we're going to throw it to break right now. If we have to pause it for the few seconds left, we will this game, okay? And we'll wrap this up on the other side because okay. they have uh, all their timeouts. Do it. Business is king, and uh, 
We must uh, throw it to a break. Justin Anderson and TC, who will win? Find out oh. next on the ticket. All right, this couldn't have been written up any better. So TC is taking on Justin Anderson in Madden football. You can see it, the final 35 seconds at theticket.com. And Justin is uh, has the Cowboys. He is on the 20-yard line. He has 80 yards to go to try and score one point. Big He's first down, down 28 to 27. Big first down there. Where would he throw, Bob? Uh, third and 10, right to Witten. But, but a sure uh, the clock is running. 24, 23, 22. First and 10 for the Cowboys. They and have their own 37. Is Justin Anderson out of timeouts? I yes, think he so. is. Rolling oh, back to feet in, though. Really nice out to Jason Witten. Stops the clock at 16, 45 seconds to go. And remember, he only needs a field goal for the win. Cowboys down what, what one. What yard line would you say he He's looking for. Boy, you probably That's need about, uh, boy, he's already really close to That's 45. Another first down, and they can be in field goal range, but there's only 16 seconds left, and there's no more first downs. Romo back to throw. Oh, looking my deep, God. Looking deep to oh. Down at the two-yard line, but it's incomplete. Boy, he threw into quadruple coverage there. Sometimes you just throw it up for Dez. Now 10 seconds yeah, to go. Remember, they have to have So time. he gets a first down. He's got to get to the boundary. And out of bounds, and Dan Bailey has a chance to win it and win a star power TV for Justin Anderson. Second and 10, Romo trying to throw. No! Finds Beasley, and he gets out of bounds. Four seconds to go. Four <laughs> seconds to go. Wow. We are going to have a chance here. Cowboys at the 24. From there, you're looking at a 42-yard field goal from Dan Bailey. 42 yards to Cowboy Boy, victory. That knee was so close. Madden Bowl 2016, Justin Anderson has the game right at the foot of Dan Bailey. Here it is. To win the game. Snap down. Hold. Kick is up. And it is good. good. <laughs> Cowboys win. Cowboys win. 30 to 28. <laughs> Justin Anderson defeats TC Fleming Man. on the final kick. Unbelievable. With an unbelievable two-minute drill from Tony Romo. Boy, Gets that the knee. ball down. That is what it is all about. And there, with the trophy.